all of his angles wrong. It's an exciting player coming on for Barca. And an exciting one coming off. Lionel Messi. And a standing ovation. Uh, he was absolutely world class. Why waste him for a full 90 minutes? The game's already out of reach for Celta. Put in one of the best He's halves. In limited action. Marnais as well. I'm curious to see where he's going to position alongside Luis Suarez. Right alongside him. And from that little bit of scare in the first few months of the season where he looked like a skeleton of his former self, a real shell. Now Dembele, the fans starting to roar. Puts on the brakes, sneaks oh, it in. Great ball. Tries to square it, but he'll settle. Well, they're going to say off the right back. It'll be a goal kick. You have to feel for Johnny. I mean, Messi taking him on. Now he has to deal with Usman Dembele, one of the most tricky technical players that you'll find. And a nightmare for a fullback because he always wants to take you on one-on-one. -on -one. He's electrifyingly quick. He doesn't force the cross in. He looks for the shorter pass. That is very much the Barcelona way. A little easier than it used to be with training centers and the like, but there are managers oh, as Dembele excellent. just touches it away from Fontes, creates a 3v1, cuts back to his left, deflected shot wide, Hugo Mayo destroying what would have been a from him. throw. No, look at this uh, counter, does well there, absorbs the challenge, he fakes like he's going to go to the inside, cuts it back out, he does have options, he did have a window to play that through ball to his left side. Yes. You know what, can't blame the youngster, he's uh, really trying to and he's nowhere near a finished product. His ceiling is, is no ceiling in sight. For Coutinho, they spent even more because they take a look and see the finished product. And also Coutinho's played in La Liga before he showed that he could... Million pounds. And then you look at the return. That was... L.A. providing Arnaiz trying to finish and then skating to a stop. Find him into stride. This is uh, more like it from Dembele. This time he doesn't try to take on the entire defense. Pleased with that pass to Arnaiz. Barcelona, it's not so much who scores as long as the team does. Rakitic back for Dembele. Dortmund got him from quick feet on a nice not so much Rakitic lofts it Suarez for Dembele just toying with Mendez promoted from Defensor's fourth team straight to the first, and he never looked back. In for Arnais. Had Dembele, tries to feed. Nice. Play on, says the ref. Not in for Suarez, feeds Dembele. Rakitic making the run. Tries the little back heel. But says this play there from Dembele. Playing the ball quickly to Rakitic, and from that position, he's going for the spectacular back heel finish. Almost done. Headed oh, into the corner by Rakitic. Header. Why? Salta defense. That is just very poor man marking. Another delivery from Mbele. And Rakitic all alone in the heart of the box. That is simply inexcusable. He's had some beautiful passes in this game. Rakitic nearly pulled off the back heel just moments ago. And now we get a free header. All the markers converging at the near posters. Why are there three players around our nice? And they have I don't two understand defensive that midfielders in there, and neither one. In the Copa del Rey, anything that Salta, I'm sure, has seen. These are used to oh. going toe to toe. Just catching Johnny flat footed. Dembele. Oh, it's <laughs> lifting it back for Suarez and almost. Well, Dembele is the joy of the game personified, isn't he? He is so fun to watch. It's 
Like a Jogo Bonito commercial, every time he touches the ball, he's Look. better than that, especially that first half. They put the game away, really, within 15 minutes. Messi couldn't have done it better. Suarez as well saw so many positive signs from him and also from some of the players that you don't see as much.